What is going on everyone? KM Dolph back for the next installment in this Transport Fever 2's River Dream series. Now, you'll notice that we're sitting somewhere different today. Um, I'm just going to let you guys know up front that last game didn't work. Uh, I don't know whether it was the double tracking or what the story was, but I ended up going through and deleting uh, the second line of the train uh, to try and get some money back because I was losing money like it was going out of fashion. Uh, things weren't happening and I let it run for about 10, 15 years and just that one train and that one bus route didn't make me a lick of money. So I also realized that I hadn't installed... Um, roading from town to town and to the corresponding, pardon me, industries. So I decided just to um, take a golfer's mulligan uh, on on the series and we're going to start again. Uh, what I am going to do is plan this a little bit better. We're going to stay on this same island. However, I'm not starting down in Trostenwald uh, simply because I don't need to. There's nothing down here except for a bit of fuel which I haven't got oil or refineries for yet anyway. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start in David W. Town, our good old favourite David W. G'day, David. Um, we're going to start David W. Town, and we're going to make our way over here to Liamsville. So it'll look different than last episode, and I apologise for that. But uh, at least with running that one train from David W. Town to Liamsville and back, I can also then incorporate, hopefully, some, some farming and some food, and at least get that back into David W. Town. Uh, and if it starts making me money, I could even branch it down into Trostenwald, because uh, they need food. Liamsville doesn't need food. He needs things that aren't even on this island. Well, there's that, but they need that. He don't need that, but that's what we're going to do. Uh, eventually, we will work on getting some oil from over here in Gresham, and we'll get that down here and get that through Evansville and over a bridge that I'm probably going to make at some point and all that fun stuff. And we can get that to there and then we can trundle that down the lot. Anyway, I'm getting way too ahead of myself. Um, without further ado, let's start episode two, Mulligan episode uh, of Transport Fever 2 River Dream series. And we'll do that right after the intro. It's Okay, and we're now back from the intro, and uh, yeah, we're still here uh, out the front of David W. Town, and we're going to start by uh, building us a, a train line, uh, because we like train lines. Uh, now, the one thing I am going to do, unlike last episode, uh, I'm only going to make this thing 80 metres long, because it doesn't need to be that big for the moment, nor is it probably ever going to need to be that big. Now, we'll sit here and we'll wallop this in and hopefully this can pick up on the farm. Are you going to pick up on the farm for me? Ah, there we go. Yes. Okay. So you'll come in on there like so. This isn't going to look as glorious as last episode and I'm apologising for that right quick. Why is that doing that? Or should I just do it along the side? No, 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 no. You know what I should do, is I should do, make it parallel with that particular thing, like so, there you go, we now have a train station, with a fair bit of a wallop of uh, whatever the hell's going on here, but that's fine, I can easily bring that down and that's not going to be a problem, but we're not going to worry about that just yet. So the train is probably going to come around the side of this mountain here because I've got a giant mountain in my way. Uh, now, where was I? Where did I build the? Uh, oh, that's right, I built it over here, didn't I? So I'm going to have to uh, encourage the wonderful people of uh, Liamsville to uh, vacate the premises. Sorry, you are all getting belated. Uh, okay, and then what we're going to do is we're going to whack this, which I'm pretty sure is where we had it last time. Yep, there you go. So we'll just whack that in there. 
We're not doing anything too crazy in this episode. Just so everyone is aware. Because if we do start doing crazies, then uh, that's where that's when the dream stops working altogether. Alright, so let's get this out to here. We're just going to build a nice, simple line through the mountains, as it were. Do we want a tunnel? I mean, where's it going to come out? Does it come, where's it come out? No, it's not even coming out. No, I don't want that. Go away. We don't want that. And I'm not spending an extra 400 bucks to do it, either. You can get nicked. No, 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 no. No. You need to come around and go into there, sunshine. Now, you want to jab me for having a little thing that goes into David W. Town. And it doesn't come out until, like, right there. Well, that's just dumb. Can I just do that? Is it going to cost me a hell of a lot less? No. It's going to cost me a hell of a lot more to plough through a mountain. Well, then I'm not doing it, am I? No, we're not. We're not having this, ladies and gentlemen. We're not having it. I'm not going down this process again of just spending money aimlessly. No, oh, I don't know about that. I don't know about that. Oh, you know what? I'm actually okay with that. Because it comes all the way out there, so that's fine. You know what? Build it. Alright, where's that little bit of lawn? Are you the bit of lawn? Yes, you are the bit of lawn. Alright, so where do you... And... Yeah, you know what? That doesn't look too terrible. A little bit of a little bit of an embankment there, but I can live with embankment. Although it'd look better if I just did it flat, because it looked like there was a bit of a lump in the old tracks, and I didn't like that too much. Yeah, you know what? It's only 500, uh, 500,000. Go with that. There you go. We have got a train line. It's a wonky one, and this looks dreadful. But once I can get some money up and running, then we'll start talking about other things. All right, road. We need to get some road stuffs in. So we are gonna. How are we gonna do this? I wonder. I could use one of these inline passenger stations, and that would look kind of cool. So we're gonna go with city old. Uh, we're only gonna do the one terminal because that's always fun. And then we're gonna stick that probably about. Come on. There you go, we're going to stick that there. And that looks nice. And we can grab one of these and we can go... Oh no, that looks terrible. Don't do that. Um, can I delete a bit of that road? I mean, I can. Game says I probably shouldn't, but I can. No, we need that to come around in a nice little loop-de-loop, uh, -loop, thank you. Can we have a nice little loop-de-loop -loop section going? Oh yeah, that... Yes! Yes, that looks nice. Nice little road down by the... Yeah, I like that. That looks nice. Alright, so... The other thing I need to do here is I need to build a train... Uh, a depot. So we're going we're gonna to whack an old, uh, an old depot out here. And I'm going to stick with this original plan that I had. Even though it's probably not going to work. Oh, see, why do you... Why do you do these things to me? Right? Why do you do these things that you do? Oh, here you go. Now, the only the only problem I've got is that that looks... Now, you know what? This can go... This can go right up against the station. How does that look up against the station there? Does it work? Stop doing things. Yeah, that looks alright. Fine, go with that. And then we're going to have to delete that bit of road. But that's fine, we can delete the bit of road. Hello, there's a bear! What's a bear doing there? Uh, we need the, the old flattening tool. We need to bring this down to my level. Yeah, this is what we need to do. We need to flatten stuff down. Because we've got a whole bunch of nonsense here that we don't really need 
There you go, that looks a bit better. And then we're going to go back and grab some more road, and we're going to go... No, we're going to try that again, and we're going to go... Ahaya. No, no, I want you to be straight, please. I need you... For this one, I just need you to be straight. There you go, just be straight with me. There you go. Lovely. We've got that. That looks good. It's happening. Excellent. Still got eight million dollars. This is good. We're going to make this work. It's going to make the dream work. Everyone's going to be happy. Uh, except for maybe yours truly. Oh, no. We've got too much too much of the curvatures. I want to bring that out to probably... Where do I want to bring that out to? Probably about here. Yeah, there you go. You can go there. Uh, I will have to put down just a little, a little signal just for a path signal. Or do I want one of these UK hemisphere signals? Now, they go on the opposite side, don't they? No, I don't want the UK ones. I like the US ones. US ones are a little bit, uh, a little bit nicer looking than that. So we'll stick that there. And that's you done. Uh, I've still got to get this bus route up and running. So we won't, uh, we won't worry too much about certain things just yet. Uh, I am going to need a, uh, a road building for the, the, the road depots. Uh, now, I'm probably going to have to stick this probably somewhere down here because that's just going to need... It's going to need all my attention, this thing. There's a tree in my way. I don't like it when trees are in my way. Get the tree out of my way. Yeah, that looks a bit better. That looks a bit better. Yeah. One up. There you go. That's you done now. Then we can whack a small street around the corner here. Well, I mean, we could do that. But I'm also not going to do that. And I'm going to bring that up to here. So that the, the, de the roads and everything have got something to go to. Autosave's doing its thing. Thank you, Autosave, for doing that thing in which you do. Uh, no, that looks god-awful. Nah, so that's just going to be a dead-end road that goes out to there. Righto. That's fine. I'm happy with that. We've got some buses. Oh, I can get some buses anyway. Uh, Alright, let's go back into the building stuffs and let's build some uh, some tram stoppage. Uh, no, we just want normal bus stoppage, thank you. Alright, so, if you're going to stop there, like that, you're already picking up half of that. Uh, where are you going to go? Because you're going to come out, you're going to come down that way, and then you're going to go back out this way. So, what we're going to need, is we're going to need to go out, probably, uh, I mean, it doesn't matter. That's all going to come in from that way. So it's not really going to matter too greatly how I go about this. So what we'll do is we'll whack one of uh, there. And then we'll come out here and we'll whack one out there. And then we'll come back around and whack one there. And then we're going to come down here and probably whack one there. And then just for fun, we'll probably whack one more there. And... Yeah, you know what? I'm kind of happy with that. Although there's nothing going up this middle section at all. Nah, which is problematic. It's only a little bit problematic, but it's still problematic. So what I might do is I might just quickly uh, re redo those ones. Might just quickly redo those ones, I think. So we'll bring you probably down to there. And then we'll bring you down to here. Now, you know what? I still like the idea of you going along that coastline there. That looks that looks nice. So we'll do that one. Right. So, David W. David W. Commuter. There you go. So you're going to start there. And then you're going to work your way out there to there to there to there. And then eventually back down to there. And then up your little thing. Giddy up. That looks good. Uh, now, I need to buy some vehicle. Nothing wrong with the old Max. So we'll chuck two Max on there because they hold nine people a pop. Chuck them on the David W. Commuter and they can get start. They can start that rolling and getting people around the township. Because that's what we like to see. Right. 
Now, over here, to Williamsville. Hello, Williamsville. Right, so you're going to need to probably go there. And then we're going to pop one of you probably here, so you can get away from that. Uh, you've also got a bit of building stuffs down here, so I'll probably drop you probably one there. And then we'll drop another one, because you got all that gear there, so I'll probably drop you there. And then we're going to drop one right quick, just on the other side of that line. And then you can just make your way back up as you go. Lovely. Right, new line. This is all happening. Liamsville commuter. Done. You're going to go one, two, three, four, five. That looks simple enough, doesn't it? And I'll send the Max down the uh, down the road line. They can go down the road because that's going to look really cool. Uh, the other thing we've got to do is we've got to make the Starter Island train line. Starter Island uh, passenger. Passenger. And then we'll go from there to you. And that's you done. Right. Let's go buy some Max. Because we need to buy some Max. We need some Mackage. Yep. Buy some more Mackage. Uh, one, two, three. You guys can all go get on the Williamsvilles. Get on, get on out. Off you go. Let's buy a train. Get the train up and running. I can't use that thing because it crashes my game. So I'm not going to use it. Uh, the Baldwin 6 class. He costs $43,000 a year. $40,000 a year. I mean, that just seems like the easy thing to do. Um, but then you got these things that can pull a hell of a lot more, 200 kilowatts, but they cost $120,000 a year. Stick with the D13 for the moment, thank you. We're not going to overdo this today. Uh, now what am I going to shove on you? One. So you're already gone mediocre on me. We can't have that. The D13 coaches. You know what? Let's just stick three on you for now. Buy you. And then we're going to whack you on the Starter Island passenger. And there's our first train. Ladies and gentlemen, the Mulligan episode of Transport Fever 2's River Dream series. And we have a new train. One that cost me a hell of a lot less. There you go. We are starting in the 1900s, which is fine. Let's watch this glorious little train do its thing. Yes, it only does 40k an hour, but that will help it in the long run. There you go. He's off. He's off doing his thing. Watch out, there's a bear! There's a bear on the line, get it off. That is one thing we'll be seeing a lot more of in this series, ladies and gentlemen, is um, uh, doovahickeys like that. We'll be seeing stuff like that happening. Uh, now, because I only need... Am I getting ahead of myself? We're only 15 minutes in. But I kind of want to already start doing this stuff. I want to do the farms. What do you got over here? You only got one person there. Well, that's a bit rude. I can't even see you. You're not even there. How rude. We should have a couple of little uh, little Max doing their little run across here. You got one person waiting for you. That's great. Where's that Mac? There it is. There's a Mac. Two people already on board. Ah, oh, giddy up. Yeah, see, there you go. That's going good. It's going great guns. We need to get rid of that money stuff real quick. See, look at this. Look at this brake wall. That looks mad. I mean, global warming will probably see an end to that. And erosion. We'll probably see that that line, that uh, bit of road collapse before long, but never mind. Oh, we got the we got the GWR top light stuff. We've got an Atlantic. We've got all these other locos that I love using. But I can't use them yet because we don't make any money. Yet. We've got to make some monies first. Money is uh, important because money is what makes the dream work. And that's what we're here to do is make the dream work. Now, if I want to build a cargo building, are you going to let me build one at all? 
Probably not. Right. What if... And I'm only saying what if... What if I did that and that, and then put my platform in? Are you gonna... Are you gonna give me any grief then? Cargo building. Oh, look at that. You're not gonna give me any more grief. Look at that. David W. Town has now got the freight. Which we love. The only thing we haven't got is double tracking all the way down this here line. Which is unfortunate. But six and a half million. I'm not going to do it this episode. Not until, not until this starts making me some coin. And we need coin. Because without coin, the dream doesn't work. I've only put in a little bit of investment so far this year, but that's not going to make me uh, a ton. This train is not going to make me a ton of cash. But we'll see what happens. So we've already got people waiting there. We've got a couple of people waiting there. There's a few Alexandria, Alexandria and Autumn are heading for the train line, which is lovely. They can do that in their own merry time over at Liamsville. Since that's all we've got at the moment... Hang on, let's see if we get a nice little... No, we can't get any shots in here. There's too many trees. Liamsville's overrun by trees. See? There's trees everywhere. There you go. Train coming into the station. There you go, that looks nice. Get some passengers on ya. There you go, you're four. You'll start making me some money shortly. These Max have only just made it. Have these Max even made it into town yet? Oh there they are. They're doing their they're doing their merry business. So this thing should start kicking up. They're on twenty kilometer an hour roads. Which is densely annoying. Why are you on that sort of a stretch of road? And why is autosave doing things that it really shouldn't be doing? They have a speed limit of 40, that's bloody why. There you go. Why don't you guys get a little bit of a, get a little bit of a boostings? Hey, eh? get some boostings. There you go. Now you guys can do a bit more speed and not have to worry so much. Because it concerns me that you're so worried about things. 25 kilometres an hour. You should be going faster than that old mate. You know for a fact that you should be. All right, we've got one going one way, one going another way. Where where are you all going? You're all moving around and splitting up, and I don't mind it. Where are you going? You're going to Oak Street. Well, that's not Oak. That's Oak. Okay, so you're going to go over there. Are you guys doing the auto spacings? You're going to Main Street. You guys are doing auto spacings. I love it. I like that a lot. Alright, now the unfortunate thing for this station is the simple fact that I'm going to have to build a little bit of a cargo something or other up this end. Now you're not going to let me do that because you're a pain in the bum. Because you're going to want it straight away. Ain't ya? Because if I don't put that in there... The game's going to hate me. There you go. And then what if I go back and want to build a, a cargo buildings now? You going to let me build a cargo buildings now? You are, but not where I want it. Not that that's a bad thing. I mean, I don't mind building that around the other side. That's actually not a terrible idea. Um, the only problem is I don't really want to... Oh, Hello. If I build that there, yeah, that way Liamsville can have a nice big one. That looks good. The only thing that doesn't look good is the uh, 
the little bit of uh, horrendousness that I'm going to have to fix right quick. Now, do you go anywhere? Because I don't think you do. And if you don't go anywhere, then uh, I'm going to fix you. And then if I do this, what if I do that? Nah, I don't like that. What are you? Are you just a git that's in my way? Well, get out of my way. Please. Sorry, but you're in my way. Now I am gonna have I am gonna have to do that because you're gonna need some help doing such things. Now I know that I know that, that road is not gonna last forever because I'm gonna have to make a change to that at some point because I can't run that over there, but I'm not terribly concerned about that for the moment. This is all just pre-prepping at the moment. You got two people on board there, that's great. How's David W. Town going over here? So you've just left the station, and you got 18 people on board. Well, that's fantastic, and you still got nine waiting. The only problem is you're a very slow train. Ah! I didn't want to do this, but I'm going to do it. I'm going to get rid of that train. I'm going to put something a little tiny bit faster on because I need... I need... I needs it. That thing does 50. This thing does 40, but it's got a pulling speed of a gnat. That costs 121000 a year. That costs $40,000 a year. 40000 a year. What do you reckon? 52 k's an hour. You know what? I say that train does not have a locomotive. Well, that's, that's because I stuffed up, isn't it? Don't, don't give me grief. Alright, so we're going to whack you on the front. And that's going to be you. You got good. Modify it. Make it happen. Now we've got a rocket. I say rocket. It does 50 kilometers an hour. But it's still faster than the other thing. Let's have a look. Let's watch him come out of the tunnel. Out you come. Come out the tunnel. Show me things. Show me things that I might be impressed by. Here he is. Hey, look at him. Yeah, see, he's not having any trouble sticking to 40k an hour. And once he gets up over this godforsaken hill that I've created, for reasons I'm not 100% sure, it's because of this. It's because of this, isn't it? That's all right. I can I can hack this. I can hack this for now. Right, you've already got 38 people waiting there. All right. I'm obviously going to need two trains for this because you've already got 12. You only carry a maximum of 18. Why couldn't you have done this in the first places? Hey? Eh? Why, I ask? Do I have any better road vehicles than these things? I don't think I do. The ducks? They only carry five. But they go 30k an hour. Yeah, go on. Go on, do that. They're kind of cute. I like them. I could probably whack another couple of it on that line as well, to be perfectly honest. 30k. Let's buy two more. And let's whack them on the David W's. Done. 20 passengers waiting. Yep, yeah, this, needs, this needs double trainage. Already. Alright, double track. To finish off the episode, we're going to double track. We're going to do exactly what I said we shouldn't do last episode, but we're going to do it anyway. Alright. Righto. This is going to be either really good or really bad. Don't know which one it's going to be yet, but we'll find out when we get there. 
we are going to find out very, very shortly. Right, that's you done. Now I've got to make you a little bit of a, one of these things. Which means your side's going to need one of them things. The old diamond crossings. And then I'm going to have to swing back over this way and do the same thing. There you go. Right. You need to go into there, like so. You need to go over there, like so. Uh, I need to quickly chuck some signals. Uh, we're going to whack that one right there. And then we're going to whack a couple on there and there. I'm not going to put any in the tunnel because that's stupid. I'll put one there. Put one there, and there. And then we're going to whack some more over here. And then we're going to have to go into the township, and then whack some more in there. Here we go, and done. Dunskies. Now, I need, a, I need to make two of you. Uh, manage vehicle. Clone. Fantastic. This should... I emphasise the word should... Start making me some solid coin. Because if it takes one train to get all the way down to the end for me to have 30 plus passengers sitting here, then, you know, I mean, that's just, that's just all giddy up. Oh, now wait, you can't, you can't go anywhere because you're stuck. Right, well, let's fix that right quick. Uh, let's go out to there. I can't do that because you're in the way. There you go. Jump on out. There you go. We'll get rid of that one. There you go. Giddy on up the line. Go for it, sunshine. There you go. Happy as a church. Hopefully now, things should start making me a bit of money. Uh, the train line's not making me any money yet. But there's reasons for that. Uh, the David W. commuter's d going gangbusters. Liamsville commuter's not doing terribly, but I am going to very quickly change his vehicles over as well. Um, only because he needs it. And these things look a lot better. And then I'm also going to give you five of them instead of uh, instead of the rest. Which means you're going to end up having to make your long trek along the highway. Which is fine. It's what it's here for. There you go. Look at this. This is all giddy up stuff right here. 18 passengers coming in. 25 passengers at the wait. This is good. This should start seeing me make some money. Look at it. Look at that cool little train. Look at him. There we go. Train line should start making. Look at that. 79k. Making all the monies. Going back full. We like this. This is the stuff that we like. And you've still left 13 passengers behind, which is brilliant. Somewhat. Uh, but yeah, there you go. So that's... That's going gangbusters. You've got some people to take back with you, which is great. I mean, I don't... What happened? What the... Look at these people. They're vanishing. Oh, no. One dude there. Oh, hello. Goodbye. 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 Oh, no, you're going to stand up there. That's interesting. All right, so there you go. Uh, that is a lot more successful of the first episode than uh, than the last one. Thank God I took the mulligan on that. Uh, what do you got over here? You got eight. Yeah, these, these things are going... This line's going gangbusters. Are you going to drop anyone off there? Nah, of course not. Why would you do that? That's silly. Silly talk. 19 people waiting. 15 people waiting. Train. One there. 
one just arriving in the station to pick up, uh, what, 61-something passengers. Yeah, that's good. I'm happy with this. I mean, I could almost upgrade these trains right now, but I'm not gonna. Because I've spent 24000 on railroads, 51000 on other investments, uh, and I'm only making 41 quid at the moment. But, I mean, that is very soon going to change. Uh, now, just while we're here, let's go back into David W. Town right quick. Uh, because what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring that back. No, I'm going to bring this back up. There it is. Uh, where's my chart? Headquarters. Let's build me a headquarters. Because we like building headquarters. And um, you know what? For fun... Where am I going to build this for fun? I mean, I could build it on the outside of the train station, and that would look kind of cool. It could go here. No, you know what? Let's put it on the other side, next to the bus, bus stop. Right, let's spin the camera around really quickly. Because I'm going to need some help with this. Because I can't... Uh, can't guarantee that this isn't going to look terrible. Yeah, there you go. Just build it there. Done. That looks great. That looks absolutely fantastic. So now I can just click on that whenever I like. And I can go, well, this is all, all well and good. Uh, nine road vehicles, two trains, top speed of 40k, top length of rail of 27 miles. Oldest vehicle's a year old already, but that's fine. That's to be expected. Total track is 5,271 metres or miles. I'm not 100% sure. Total tunnels, 875. I'm going to say that's metres. I'm going to say it's not miles. People transported a lot. There you go. That's good. And there's headquarters sitting right there. Dunskies. Uh, have I got trains? 18 people coming back. Where's the other one? Here it is. You're also going to have 18 people coming back because you still got 40 passengers waiting at David W. Station. Which is marvellous. I mean, realistically, I could put a better train on here. But I'm not... I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to withdraw from doing so. I'm just going to run these little... These little Stevensons for now until there's some money to be made from it all. Because there, if there's anything we do know, there's money to be made from all of this. 35 people. Yeah. It's a terrible idea. I don't know why I'm thinking it. But I am thinking it. You all know that I'm thinking it. Fine, I'm doing it. Last thing I'm doing, and then I'm, that's it for the episode today. Because I've had to stuff around with way too much, and it's not been that... Not been that easy. Uh, okay, let's replace you. Let's do these little saddle tanks because they're fun. One of you. And then I'm going to want... Six-wheeled coach? I mean, that looks kind of fun. And that's a 20 capacity. That's not terrible either. Yeah, you know what? Do that. I want to see what that looks like. There you go. Six-wheeled wagons with a saddle tank. Because why the hell not? 20 passengers on board. Train's turning around and getting out of here. Go, son. There you go. And you've still got 20-something passengers waiting at the station. Yeah, I'm, I'm happy with that decision to do that. How's this look? Yep. Cute little saddle tank doing its thing. Six-wheeled wagons. I like it. It's already making me $177,000 a year, which is even more marvellous. And then you got this one. Hang on, I just did a big zoom very quickly, and I'm sorry about that. This one's already making $14,000 a year, but by the time that gets back to town, that's going to be making me a solid quid. And I'm down to $2 million. That's fine. We can hack this. This will work. This will definitely, definitely work. 
or else I shouldn't be making transport fever videos. <laughs> Man, there might be a few in the comment section that would probably suggest I don't anyway, but, you know, it is what it is. And this is going to make for a nice little siding aspect. I've got some more siding aspect over here. I could always bring this back a little bit. Yeah, I can make this look good. This series will look good. Uh, so, folks, there you go. That is going to do it for today's episode of the Mulligan episode of, season, of uh, episode one. Uh, make sure you leave a like on this video. Uh, if you've got suggestions or comments you want to put on this series, feel free to chuck a comment in the comment section below, and uh, I will endeavour to look into things for you. Uh, if you want things named after you, again, chuck your name in the comment section below, and I might do so. For those that regularly comment on my stuff, you have already got stuff named after you in this series, which will be unveiled in time. The only reason that... Uh, David W. Town and Liamsville get such a high mention is because they're some of my higher commenting uh, subscribers. Here we go. Watch this. Look at that. Money. Make me all the money in the world. Take your 20 and get out. Why does it keep doing that? I hate this. Right. You come here. Look at that. You're already making me 250 quid. You are going gangbusters. This should go away rather quickly. Because I've made a lot of investment. That's why I'm not making any money. Uh, but this is going good. Once we get past this year, I should start making some serious bucks. Which is going to be fantastic. Railroad. Road is making a lot of money. This is making good money. This will go away soon. And life as we know it will be absolutely amazing. Uh, but yes... Um, like and follow me on Facebook as always guys and uh, don't forget to click the notification button so you can get up to date with all things KM Dolphin click that subscribe button if you've got time show your love uh, show your support for everything that I'm doing with YouTube I've been doing this for a couple of years now you'd think I'd be better at it but you know it is what it is and um, as we sit here at David W Town waiting for a train to come and we have a quick look at the fact there's 15 passengers still waiting and there's a whole bunch of people here waiting to go into town, and everything is looking quite good. Uh, guys, I will see you for the next installment of Transport Fever 2, River Dream Series. Take care, everyone. <laughs>